What's up, everyone? This is OK Chief, and I got some more mail. If I'm sitting here in front of you with a box in front of you, that means I got some more mail. Now, this one's really cool because this one comes all the way from Puerto Rico. And it comes from an awesome gentleman named Pedro Santana. No relation to Santana the musician. Unless you are. Unless that, would be, that would be fucking awesome if you, do, if you were. But this one comes... All the way from our awesome country or state, I'm sorry, Puerto Rico, and um, it's come a long way. I mean, Puerto Rico is not exactly around the corner, so I'm uh, really excited to get this. I don't know what it is or 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 who exactly sent it. I didn't get no prior warning that this was coming in. It's here. Let's get to it. Hopefully, there's a note. Hopefully, there's a note attached. There is a note. I see it. I see it right off the bat here. Okay. And there is a note. And oh my god. Holy shnikes. Oh look, he put his little poor. I know the little. The little cookie. They call it cookie. Because I'm from Chicago. And while I am Mexican, the majority of my girlfriends and all my best friends in Chicago were all Puerto Rican. So I know this little guy well. His name's Koki. They call him Koki. It's a tree frog. And um, in Chicago, they used to sell the clickers. I guess they were like keychains, and you would click the bottom of the frog, and it just click. It just used to make a little clicking sound. I guess the noise that those little tree frogs would make. And uh, they call them Kokis. I don't know why, but they did. And that's awesome to see that here. So, oh my God, he took some time with this letter. It looks all professional. Letterhead, everything looks good. So let's get to the letter. It says, Greetings, okay, Chief. Hope all is well. Me and my buddy Alberto enjoy watching your videos and also enjoy being members of your group over the Facebook. Sadly, we are unable to dumpster dive over here in Puerto Rico. I am a guy who posted those pics of my collection room some time ago, which you asked if it was, if it was a store. I do have a YouTube channel where I review toys, but I have been unable to post anything new. We would like to show our appreciation and your late birthday present included inside the box are locally made candy. No. Oh, sweet. We hope you will enjoy. Also, oh, it says ho we hope you and will enjoy. <laughs> I almost left this fucking name out there. I didn't even, I made, that was a little trick there. Um, also, some prints from local artists who are friends of mine. Since I know you are a turtle fan of a certain character, I hope you enjoy the items. Oh, I love Raph. Watch it be Raph. Uh, let's see here. Uh, if you would like more of the snacks, please let us know and we will send them your way along with something for Will. Sorry, but only snacks for him this time. But don't worry, you are still awesome. Thanks for all that you have done and continue to do. Happy late birthday and wonderful day. Pedro Shadow Magnus at YouTube. So his name on YouTube is Shadow Magnus. So I will be checking him out and I hope you do as well. I'll be leaving a link down to his channel down in the description below. So don't forget to give him a little click. Check him out if you like what you see. Subscribe. I will be doing the same, and let's get to Shadow Magnus, a.k.a. Pedro. Wow, this is awesome. I'm very excited to see what type of snacks you guys got. If you're out from Chicago, you know Humble Park was my breeding ground, if you will, my stomping ground. And uh, they had wonderful little trucks there where you would buy these little snacks. Um, acapurias, or uh, bacalaitos, or... Or paparellos. Oh my God! I'm already salivating. I'm already watering. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. That shit brings back really good memories. And I have, in no way, shape, or form, access to that. That stuff is 1,200 miles away. I wish I knew how to cook it. I wish I knew how to cook it. I don't know how to cook it. I just I dream about shit like that. I dream about acapurias and and just like just just fresh off the oil paparellos. You know, just. Crunchy, ah, oh, ah, oh, let's get to his package. Let's just get to his package. 
Holy cow, there's right off the bat, there is a Transformer, and it is Bumblebee! It's Cyberfire Bumblebee, everyone. Look at this. I actually have um, a, a packaging like this, but with laser beak. And now I have one with Bumblebee, Cyberfire Bumblebee. Look at that awesome paint job. Check out that paint job, everyone. And this is what he looks like transformed. That is freaking sweet, brother. Holy cow. I'm not opening this. This is saying this is so freaking awesome. This is going I'm getting more shelving units as uh, I I go on throughout the months here and uh, everything's getting on shelves. It's getting thrown off up on shelves so it can all be displayed and this will be an item that is worthy of displaying. This is awesome. Thank you, Pedro. Thank you so much. We're getting down to some more stuff here. Wow, look at this. This looks to be old because of the yellowing on the plastic. This is from 1999 and it is a Dragon Ball Z. It says try me, but I highly doubt the batteries are still. Um, damn, but this is fucking cool. Look at this. This is a clip on keychain light. Collect them all. I don't know how many there are, but there's probably quite a few of them. Uh, it says try me, but I don't squeezable. Try me, squeeze a pull tab on back, then press chest. There's no oh oh, it's fudge cakes. I it does I I can't. It's probably out of batteries, but this thing's badass, nonetheless. Fucking sweet. This is Goku, probably in Super Saiyan two, two, three is like the long long hair, so that's got to be Super Saiyan one or two. That's awesome. Thank you, my friend. Freaking sweet. I love Dragon Ball. And my brother does, too. We have Romance of the Three Kingdoms 7. Wow, I have Romance of the Three Kingdoms 3 for the NES. And, um, damn, I didn't know they went all the way up to... The, I didn't know... what They're probably way past this already. If this is 7, and this is PlayStation 2, if they came out... For like later gens, and then they're already past seven. Holy shit, I didn't even know there were that many. That's awesome. I tried playing it for the Nintendo. It's a little out of my league. Let's see if the PlayStation version is any different. Maybe it plays a little easier. Oh, dude. Oh, no. Oh, 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 I'm sick. Oh, I don't have this one. Dude, this is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Night, Mutant Nightmare. Check that out. I don't have this. This is for the GameCube. It's a two-disker. Look at that. Oh, this is awesome, brother. Disc one and disc two. That's how big this game is. It requires two discs. I don't know if you can see their faces, but look how awesome their faces look there. That is freaking sweet, brother. You know me. You know what I like. And I like Turtles. I like Transformers. And I like Dragon Ball. And you all, the first three items right off the bat were home runs, brother. This is freaking awesome. Freaking awesome. We're not done. We're not done. There's this is a bunch of stuff. Man, this made it all the way from Puerto Rico, everyone. Oh, and don't forget, he did say there were snacks in here. So, oh... No, I haven't even started on this series yet, dude. You popped it off. You popped my cherry. This guy's a cherry popper. Look at this, everyone. Holy cow, I haven't started on this series yet. These are just so new that I haven't got out there and found these yet. And he got me the movies Ninja Turtles Raphael. Holy shnikes, look at all the ones I have to start collecting. I was about to start this series off. I was about to start. I swear to God, I was looking for them. Haven't found them yet. Now, I, my efforts have to go double time because I have my very first Raphael movie. Movie. April O'Neil is actually, um, Megan, Megan, fuck is her name? Megan Fox. Brain fart. Megan and Fox is so hot. I'm not sure. I mean, a lot of people are going to ask me what my thoughts on the on the movie are. I saw the trailer. I wasn't exactly thrilled about the trailer. 
Um, Michael Bay fucked up Transformers Age of Extinction. I know a lot of you guys are going to be like, Woo, that was a great movie! I know. It wasn't for me. I, I don't want to go into it too much because I know there's going to be a lot of people upset about it. But personally, for me, I could not get into that fucking movie. I just couldn't. I'm sorry. Michael Bay, please don't fuck up this one for me. Um, we'll see when it comes out. I give, him the ch I, I give the movies a chance. I at least go watch them because I support the series. I don't necessarily support Michael Bay. I support the brand, the name, Ninja Turtles, Transformers, anything I love. I support. My fucking walls are fucking littered with all the shit I support. So please, Michael Bay, don't fuck with my youth, man. But thank you, Pedro. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven to pick up. I've got seven of these bad boys to pick up. I would have had eight, but thanks to Pedro, I don't have eight. I've got seven. So thank you so much, my friend. Thank you. We have a... What is this? <gasps> Look at this! Oh, these are the things that you, they sold in those little things. I've always wondered what they were. Look at this one's a raft. They sell these um, right at the register, the cash registers, and um, I never knew what they were. I, I couldn't open them. I, could, I never opened them. This is freaking cool. That's a little mini raft, which is going on the shelf, everyone. It's going on the toy shelf. Freaking sweet. Oh, and it even comes with some instructions. Nice. Put that back in there. So that is a little pill with raft in it. That's <laughs> sweet. So we're coming down here to the bottom. I think these are the snacks. They are the snacks. Oh, are these snacks? Oh, these are snacks too. No. Oh, brother. Oh, are these? What are these? Are these macaroons? What are these? Besitos de coco. Shut the fuck up. Kisses of coco. Nut. They look like little coconut macaroons, everyone. Oh, I'm super excited to try these. I love coconuts. Almond Joy is my all-time favorite fucking candy, coconut. And these besitos de coco, which are kisses, coco kisses. That's what they are, coco kisses is what they're called. I can't wait to dip into these. Heck yeah, there is more. There's more. They've got mantecadito. Mantecaditos Grajea. They're like shortbreads. They're like shortbread cookies. Mexicans have these in their bakeries all day long, but they're a little bigger and they sprinkle these on top. These are the same exact things. I'm like, don't see it on top there. There's like sprinkles. These are just like cookies. These are cookies with sprinkles on top. These are freaking delicious. And when you have them bigger, they're even better. But these are better because they're portable. You can actually take these on the road and do, these you can pop like, like fucking Tic Tacs. I love these. Holy cow. I buy these at the bakery, but they're a lot bigger. I've never seen a mobile size. This is too cool. There's another one. Check that. Oh, but this is different. This one has raspberry on top. Guayaba. Guayaba. Doesn't that sound exotic? Everyone say it with me. Guayaba. That is what's on top. There's like a cream. There's like a cream on the very top that they dab. And that's guayaba. Guayaba is like a, it's a tropical fruit. Uh, my mom loves guayaba, by the way. And um, they seem to have sprinkled some on the very top of this cookie. Wow, man. These are awesome. These are freaking awesome. I'm so glad they made it through customs. Because they can be... You know, on food a little bit. Um, ooh, these look like almond cookies. These are called polvorones. Polvorones, everyone. That's like, for me, these look like almond cookies. I cannot wait to try these. Oh, my God. I want to try these, but I don't want to open them all at once because that'd be a freaking waste because I can't eat them all tonight. And they'd all go stale. So I couldn't do that to these cookies. I couldn't maybe down the line in the future maybe in a couple of days you have to be fast before they go expire because I gotta eat these fast um, maybe Will and, Will and I will do some now here is an entire freak there's something else at the bottom here here's an entire bag check that out an entire bag of freaking lollipops look at these these look like marshmallows but they're not they're hard you see they're hard candies but they look like lollipops 
And there's all different kinds, or they look like marshmallows, I'm sorry. They're all different types of flavors, look at that. These all different kinds of flavors. Oh, this one has some type of sesame seed at the bottom. Check that out. And there's all kinds of flavors. Look, pink. This looks like cocoa. This looks, no, nope, that's not cocoa. This looks good though. That really looks good. Oh, they have one like this. Oh, there's a dog tag in here. Puerto Rico Comic Con. That's a very popular Comic Con. I saw the Toy Hunter go to the Puerto Rico Comic Con where he tried to sell all his, um, what did he take? He tried to take local stuff, but it didn't sell very good. The good, the stuff that sold very good was the Star Wars stuff, because Puerto Rico loves Star Wars. And uh, this is awesome. That means you went to Comic-Con out there for you to get this. This is freaking cool, brother. You rock. Thank you so much. Ooh, look at this one. This one looks like pineapple. I gotta try this one. This one looks good. I'm sorry, but this shit. You can't put food in my face and not expect me to fucking eat it. Mmm. <sighs> that is pineapple. This is like a pineapple. How do you say? I can't explain them. They're they're like fruit candies. That's all I can. They're like fruit candies, and they taste like pineapple. And I fucking love pineapple. Yum, yum, yum. Well, that's it for the snack, but there's one more thing, everybody. Stay with me. There's prints. There's prints right there. These are prints. Oh, my God. Be careful. Be careful, everybody. DC Comics, the new 52. This has to be a poster. The Joker. Come on, everybody. Open up. Careful. There we go. Look at that. Can you see it? Because I can't. What does it say? I see the Joker. The Joker's back! Death of the Family! Ooh! Oh, wow. This is cool, bro. I know one person is gonna love this. Right? Am I right? Am I right? This is dope! Holy cow! Okay, we got that. Carefully pack that away. Careful. We have... Dorkly! No way! In the back, it's there's a Dorkly. Um, I watched Dorkly. That is fucking cool. Dorkly. Uh, this is the new 52. Future's End. Check that out, everybody. Gonna give this a go. That's fucking sweet. Oh, wow. That guy looks fucked up on the cover. Lois Lane. Okay. Ooh, the Amazing Spider-Man. Who am I? Marvel, this is number one down here at the bottom. Check that out, everybody. Holy shit. Gonna give this a read. Ooh, we got some fucking awesome characters there in the back. Oh, look, he's got... What's this guy's name? Electric Shock? This guy right here. I can't remember his fucking name. Fuck. Fuck, it, fuck, fuck. This is awesome. Oh, look at this, everybody. Look at... Oh, look at this. Okay, we got Tommy. The White Ranger. We... Oh, my God. We've got Tommy the Green Ranger. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at this one. Oh. Oh. Look at this one. Look at the rap. Fucking insane, everyone. Oh, this is fucking frame worthy. Be careful with this. Look at this. This looks like Heath Ledger. This is amazing. Oh my god. Look at. Oh my god. Mm hmm. It is I, Yoda. Mm hmm. Damn, this is dope! Oh my god, it looks like it's it's been fucking drawn on. It's a print, but you could tell, like, this guy drew... Man, this is dope. This is dope. It says Villa Real at the bottom. Villa Real. Right there. And then, of course, this awesome print of Batman. Look at this, everyone. Batman. Fucking 
awesome, everyone. Where's that fucking note? Is it the bottom here? No, it's over here. Wow. This package was insane. Awesome. I know it probably ran a little longer than I would have liked to, but shout outs to Shadow Magnus on YouTube. Do not forget to check him out. This was an amazing package. Thank you so much, Pedro. You fucking rock. This whole package rock. I'll be sharing this with Will. I'm sure it's going to put a smile on his face once he gets off of work and he checks this stuff out. Holy shit, thank you so much, brother. And don't forget, everybody, to check out Shadow Magnus. So I'll be leaving that link down in the description below. I'll be checking him out. I hope you check him out, too. Till the next time, everyone, which there will be because I got two more fucking packages to do here. I'm going to do them back to back. So, um... Now that I got my voice back, I'm just going to pump these out because I'm going to be busy the whole week. So stay tuned for the next two. Uh, the next one's going to be someone you know. So look out for that one. That'll be up next. So until the next one, everyone, this is OKG420. Peace out, y'all.